<laughs> oh, hey, have you ever heard that getting through high school can be tough? And that getting into college can be even tougher? Well, we're here on this cold December morning at Kent Meridian High School to tell you a little bit about a program that could help you with both of these things. That program is called the International Baccalaureate Program. This is a college prep program here at KM, and we're here to tell you what it is, what it isn't, and how it just might help you get through high school, get into college, and have fun while you're doing it. My name's Ella Johnson. And I'm William Doherty. Come on with us while we explore the Kent Meridian IB program. TOK stands for Theory of Knowledge, and it's a zero period class, which means it meets at 6.40 every morning. Let's go inside and see what it's all about. Um, yes, wrestling. You know what? I personally think that, no, no, I, I feel that Paw Patrol is just right-wing propaganda for kids to be more supportive of the police. You absolute liberal. Facts don't care about your feelings. Okay, okay, sit down, both of you. Remember that TOK is a place for us to understand why we think what we think. And it's also a place for us to value each other's opinions in a safe environment. Period. TOK is a required part of the IB Diploma. We talk about areas of knowledge like art and science, and how we know them, like through emotion and logic. It might seem hard to wake up this early just to come to school, but think of it more like having an interesting conversation with your friends over breakfast. TOK is a part of the diploma program, so if you are not taking the full IB diploma program, you will not be required to take it. Well, Ella, you guys forgot your donuts. You. Thank you guys so much. I was wondering, Miriam and Mariella, can you explain the difference between IB Diploma and IB Certificate? Yeah, I wondered that too. Certificate is when you take one or more IB classes and you can mix and match them and interchange them with um, other CAM core class electives. That way you can keep doing all the things you like, such as band, cooking, or woodworking. That makes sense. So what about IB Diploma? What makes it different? Diploma is when you take all IB classes, and it includes TOK, the Extended Essay, and CAS, which is Creativity, Activity, and Service. It's really a program all to itself, but it's really rigorous and prestigious. Thanks, guys, and thanks for the donuts. No problem. See you later. Well, let's go check out some of the classes that you can take, whether you're an IB Diploma or IB Certificate. Yeah, let's see how many classes we can visit in the next minute. have so many different class choices. They sure do, although I wonder what type of student would be good in an IB class. I've heard they're hard, but I thought they were kind of fun. Wait, Catherine, Macaulay, what do you guys think? Who's a good student to take an IB class? 
I think anyone can take an IB class. I mean, teachers are teachers after all, and they want us to succeed. Yeah, literally, if you're struggling, the teachers are always going to be there to support you, so no matter what, you're always going to have some sort of system to get back on, even if you're starting to take a fall. And, like, even though English may not be your first language, the great thing about IB classes is they're designed for everyone. And, honestly, it's worth the extra work to try and take something else and just try it out, even if you're not sure about it, because it's a lot of fun. And, no matter the extra work, it's good. Wow, thank you guys. Oh, look at the time. You guys are about to get to class before you're late. Oh. You know, well, the other thing I've heard about IB students is that it's way too time consuming and they have no life. Well, let's go talk to some students about the extracurriculars that they do. I'm your ASB treasurer. I do swim, tennis. I work at Chuck E. Cheese. I do tennis. I'm president of Filipino club. Wrestling captain. I play hockey. I play tennis. I swim. I work at the camp pool. I work at the YMCA pool. Uh, <laughs> I forgot. I worked at Snowflake Lane in Bellevue. I do cross country. I'm a part of the sportsman club. I tutor. I work down at Maggie's. And I, I tutor after school, math students. I do tennis. I am Interact President. I'm Senior Class Secretary and I am NHS Secretary. I play in a youth symphony. Um, College Success Foundation. I work at Safeway. Created Tonic Group. I am ASB President. <laughs> Band. I do jazz band. Um, so I work at Meridian Valley Country Club. I'm an orchestra. Orchestra. Okay, so I do judo for high school. I do club. I'm in National Honor Society. I do NHS. I uh, do NHS. I do NHS. Um, I do NHS and I do deco. I'm in NHS. I'm NHS treasurer. I've been an anime connoisseur. Um, I'm part of DECA, I'm in Girls Who Code Club, and I'm part of FBLA and Maud UN. And I help students with Spanish tutoring. I do theater, NHS, tennis, swim. I have an internship at a local congressional office. It's build this group, and I work at Taco Time. And I work at Taco Time. I work at Taco Time. I'm a Kent Library volunteer. I'm also in the Youth Symphony program, and I'm a senior in Girl Scouts. People sure are busy here, Cam. But even though they're in the IB program, they still have time to do the things that they love to do. Yeah, and I saw a lot of things that I'd like to try too. But the main thing about the IB program is it can help you get into college. So how does it do that? I hear a lot of people in Ms. Drake's room. Let's go in there and see what they have to say about IB and college applications. You. Yeah. Everybody. It looks like you're looking at college stuff and filling out applications. Yeah, can you guys tell us how the IB program helps you with this? Well, I'm applying to Pepperdine in California, and they specifically ask if I'm in the IB program. It's one of the things they look for. You said they wanted to know the same thing, and so when I record my classes, they asked me if it was IB or not. Overall, it seems like colleges want to know if you took advantage of the most rigorous courses offered at your school. For KM, that is the IB program for sure. Besides, all the writing and thinking we do in IB has definitely prepared me to write my college application essays. And our teachers were super helpful with helping us with the application and making sure our essays were good. That sounds great, but I definitely want to sign up for IB now. That's a great idea. I will too. Now that we've heard about all the advantages of the program, I can't wait to try out the classes and the activities. I can't wait to sign up for IB, but what if I have more questions? Go see Miss Shoemaker! Where is she? Room 243! What's her email? Bed <laughs>